Hi guys, how are you doing? Hope you are good. How are your family members? How is work? How is business? How are your kids? How is your husband? How is your wife? How is everybody? <laughs> Hope you are good. So today's video is going to be really short. It is a question I want to ask you. So let's get to this. Welcome back to the channel. My name is Christy and this is Christy Spurs. On this channel, what we do is motivate ourselves to live our best lives in God. And I also share with you a license as Countryman Canada. But today what I'm going to be doing is ask you a question from the scriptures. Like there's there's a place I've read, I think I've read that book about twice now, but uh, somehow, 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 when any time, in those times I've read that book, the end, I still feel kind of like, <laughs> What happened in this story? And um, that's the question I'm asking you today. So this one is a Bible Bible study that we want to use it to do. But it will be done in the comment section because, of course, we can't do lives yet. And um, so we have to make do with this. But really, this is not just about um, shooting a video or something. It's actually something I've, um, I've that's been, you know, this matter, I've, I've had some some misgivings or some feelings about that i'm not sure how to I'm, I'm really not sure how to feel about that story and the story is the story of job the story of job and if you have not read the story of job i think you should because that is what would um, maybe make you understand how i feel about the story and of course you've seen the title of the video and you know that so this is the question i want to ask one time i read that book i actually felt like um it was a case of um it was a case of bullying, kind of. I don't know. I don't know how to say. I don't know how to. I mean, I don't know how to understand it. I mean, I don't know how to. But I don't understand the story, and really, that's the reason for this video. I want you to share with me in the comment section what you feel about the story of Job. Is it no? Is it no? It's not what you feel about the story of Job. It's about what you understand by the story of Job. What if you have read it at some point and you got an inspiration from God? about that story or you got an explanation from from the holy spirit about the story i want to, i would like you to share with me in the comments because i really need to i don't know but i really need to you know hear other views hear other opinions hear other you know other you know um, exposition about that story because um i remember that um, one of the i might leave um, some of the um reference on this on the screen some of the most of the things job said in most of the things he said was about how he knew that he had not sinned against god how he was sure that um he had been living only how he was sure that uh, at some point was like he's, he's not even sure it is um important to live only to god because even when you live only it's um there's no reward or something something like that and you could see you could say that it was because of the things he went through and um you know of course he knew that the scripture recorded that he makes sacrifices anytime he makes sacrifices for his um on behalf of his children in case any of them have done anything wrong and all that so we know that he was a meticulous person in ensuring that he lived the only life like he was meticulous he was he tried as much as he could to be careful and you know of course because so he was living only was because was the reason god um showed him off to the devil to say can't can you see my child is living only and all that and god gave the permission for the devil to you know touch his belongings but not his life and of course so we knew that all the time job was saying that um he knows he has been holy he knows he has lived a righteous life and all that and his friends were just saying that well all i could um, deduce from all the things his friend said was you cannot be too sure it's not possible for god to punish someone that is that has lived only it's not possible for god to punish someone that doesn't have sin so for you to be going through this thing you're going through that means you have sinned and job kept saying that he's sure he had not sinned and from the beginning of these scriptures we knew that job had not sinned abby but what got me confused was when god um decided to respond to job and some of the things I responded with was, um, were you there when I created the heavens? Were you there when, you know, was like, you were not, you can't be, you can't be so sure of yourself and all that. Um, you can't know more than God and all that. So you can't be more perfect than God. You can't say, 
you can't be more perfect than God in short. And um, at some point, Job had to apologize to say he was sorry and all. And God said he should bless his friends. And and the scripture recorded that God um, restored him, gave him back all the material things he lost, and he also had more children. But I, I, I was not clear about that. You know, there was no point where God actually told Job that really you had been living a righteous life. This was just like a test of your faith. There was no point. And I, I don't know. I can't, I don't know. So if there's any, you know, exposition, any explanation, any that you have about the story of Job, or you have read something somewhere that explained that story to you, please share with us. Because I don't know. Believe it, I'm, could I be the only one looking for more in-depth to this story? Share with us in the comment section. I know more people want to hear your opinion about the story of Job. We want to hear your, I want to hear your opinion and I know other people want to hear your opinion too. So if you have any, or if you have further questions about Job, ask in the comment section. And I know that the other Bible scholars that also watch this channel or somehow this, our question will get an answer. That will be led by God's spirit. So share with us in the comments. No, you know I'm I'm not saying share with me now because I I know that other people too might want to you know see the answer you have for this story. This we need more lights on this story of Job. Thank you for watching. You know I said it was going to be short. It seems like it's the shortest I've done in a long while. So share with us in the comments. Thanks for watching. I'll be expecting your response in the comments section. And in case you have not subscribed to the channel, please subscribe to the channel. This is actually a channel where we motivate ourselves to live our best lives in God. So you don't want to miss out any of the videos that will be posted on this channel. So click on the subscribe button and turn on notifications. Till we see in the next video, have a beautiful life. Bye.